everybody. I have one minute to tell you why I'm all dressed up. It all starts with the story of Purim, which started in the 5th century BCE. A Jewish girl named Esther was forcibly taken into a beauty contest to decide who would be king for the queen for Ahasuerush. She won. She became queen. And then the advisor Haman gets the king to agree to genocide all of the Jews in the land. He made gallows to hang Mordechai, who was the Jewish leader and Esther's uncle. If you get enter the king's palace without being invited, you will be killed. Even the queen will be killed. Esther decided to go in uninvited and reveal that she was a Jew. She took the risk. She did, and it worked. He let her in, and he hung Haman and his ten sons in the gallow built for Mordechai. And all the Jews, instead of being killed, killed their enemies. Everything flipped around. It's listed as a holiday that great miracles, ha miracles happened. But they are all hidden in the political maneuverings. We dress up because God was hidden in the story. God always plays peekaboo, but it's always, it's always hard to find him. But it's our job to find him. Happy Purim. By the way, ten Nazi masterminds were killed, hung, on the same date that was predicted in the Megillah, which is the Purim storybook.